After nearly three decades with CNN, Lou Dobbs parted ways with the cable news network to pursue new opportunities. That pursuit led the Texas-born financial guru to his latest home at Fox Business Network. And brand new Fox Business Network anchor Lou Dobbs is joining us live this morning now to talk about his career. Good morning, Lou. Can you sort of compare and contrast what it was like going from CNN to what it's been like now with Fox Business? Yeah, I'm happy. I'm home. I'm thrilled. How's that? <laughs> well, were you feeling stifled or hamstrung at CNN? And, and what kind of latitude are you getting at Fox, Lou? Uh, well, first of all, uh, Kevin McGee, uh, the, the head of Fox Business, said that, you know they hired Lou Dobbs. They want me to be Lou Dobbs, and I'm I'm thrilled to oblige. Uh, the people of Fox, uh, from the, from the management team that Roger Ailes has put together, uh, uh, you know, through uh, through our production staff for the show, is just you know, it's an amazing group of people. Fun to work with. They're positive, supportive, committed professionals. It's just a great atmosphere, a great organization. Are you, are you suggesting that it's sort of a night and day comparison? Because it sounded as if though the parting of ways with CNN was not exactly uh, the the most friendly. <laughs> Well, I think, uh, well, I was certainly happy uh, to be, uh, you know, to be uh, on my way to a, a far better uh, organization, uh, in in my view. Uh, you know, I, I'm not sure how they feel about it all, but uh, I, I do know that they've made some management changes since then, and I hope the... You know, I, I hope that people are as happy there as I am here. Well, needless to say, you are an outspoken commentator, Lou. How much was the view on illegal immigration a factor in this move? You know, I really don't know what uh, the issues were. You know, I'm a I'm a I'm a guy who asks questions and insists on answers. Uh, it makes no sense to me that, uh, for example, uh, we are still dealing with this issue. Uh, truly, uh, six years after the first legislation had been brought forward by. Uh, Senators uh, uh, McCain and uh, Kennedy, uh, and, and yet uh, there's this constant refusal on the part of uh, uh, Washington, D.C. to look straightforwardly and speak directly to the American people about the motivation, uh, the facts of the of the issue. Uh, and I, you know, I continue to, to focus on getting those questions answered, whether it's free trade, whether it's illegal immigration, whether it's border security, uh, you know, whether it is, uh, you know, the Fukushima uh, Daiichi plant in, in Japan and, and the impact on global uh, nuclear industry. Now, Lou, I have to confess, I'm a big fan of your books here. I know that you are very heavy on the free trade agreements and the way that we seem to be going with a borderless North America. Are, right. are you getting any restrictions at all editorially in terms of what it is you're allowed to talk about at Fox? None whatsoever. None whatsoever. Uh, you know, I'm pretty much an open book here myself. Uh, you know, I've got a career of over, you know, over three decades. Uh, my views, my judgments, my analysis, uh, uh, the positions that I've taken are a matter of public record, and uh, everyone knows where I'm coming from. My audience expects me, John, to uh, to take a position, uh, to provide analysis and perspective, uh, and uh, and not to shrink from tough and complicated issues. Best of luck. We look forward to hearing more about what you have to say, Lou. Laura, thank you so much. Great to be with you guys. You as well. Fox Business Network anchor Lou Dobbs.